she broke her leg. Mm -hmm. You have to go to surgery. Oh, we forgot to take your seat. Good job. And I can't find it. And it makes me mad. Sleep last night. Good. Do you have any good dreams, Laura? I always have the best dreams. Me, Isaac, and Elise were having fun flying up to the clouds and doing the Star Wars characters. And the second one, we all died. Is this your hairdo for this morning? Can you turn around so I can see it? Her friend Lucy had this hairdo and she wanted it just like Lucy. We're just resurrecting Lucy's curls from last night. Yeah. I like curls. this time of year because the kids are all learning Christmas songs. Good sharing. <laughs> that looks pretty fun. Are you happy with that little piece? Does your Mr. Potato Head have a lot of hands? Whoa, that is an awesome design. How many hands does he have? Two, three, four. Four hands? Two. That's a cool Mr. Potato Man. Can you make that face? Nailed it. Okay, Janae update, she is now nine months old. How is that even possible? She is crawling all over, pulling herself up to a stand. She says, hi, dad, dad, and she says, mmm, when she wants me. She's adorable, and we love her. Keep going. broke her leg. Mm -hmm. Pretend. Oh, just for pretend? Uh-huh. This and is quite the cast. How are you feeling? A little bit sick. A little, a little bit, bit sick. Pretending. Oh, good. I'm glad it's just pretending and you're really okay. Yes. Who's your doctor? I am. And um, I'm trying to find as much things on the computer as we can. Um, Caleb's our helper. How are things on the computer gonna help fix her broken foot? Oh, um, we bought hamburgers and banana <laughs> with no bananas, of course, and an elephant, and it's gonna come here in one minute. And how's that gonna help her broken foot? Well, the cast will. <laughs> Since she can't get up, we're well, bringing I'm her to her seeing if it's okay right now. Oh, are you looking at an x-ray? We'll get well soon, little girl. Okay, I have this to remember. Oh, Caleb made that, huh? No. Are you signing her cast? I'll just do hearts. There we go. Isaac, do you wanna sign her cast? Janae wants to sign her cast. Did you find the problem? Yep. It's just, she rolled her ankle all the way to the other side of her foot, so then it cracked. Whoa, can I see the crack? Whoa. Uh-oh. Nay, are you trying to get it? She says, I wanna play. This is really nice, can I sign your cast? Sure. Mom. That looks like a W. It does, because you guys are upside down. Hey! Um, hey right, Janae. Hi, look at that little hand. Time for surgery. Whoa, you have to go to surgery. Good luck. I hope you survive. Uh, Kayla. <laughs> because, because we're consuming the best on, Kayla. Kayla doctors ever. Oh, you guys are the best doctors ever? Yep. All right, good luck with surgery. Yep. How's the surgery going? It's super bad. Did the sur My job is to look at it and see if she's good or not. So then who's the surgeon? I am. Ooh. I'm the nurse. The nurse? Are you also the surgeon? Yeah. Does this mm. hurt? Yeah. Okay, so I think it's like right, right here. <laughs> oh, we forgot to put your sleeve. We cut it open. You cut it open? Uh -huh. <gasps> Ew. Now you're taking pictures like ultrasounds and x-rays and things? Uh-huh. How are you the doing? Are you holding twisted. up okay? The bone is twisted totally. You're doing really well for your surgery, Laura. 
Are you being so brave? Take her off her foot. Take her. Hey, does, does Let that me stick it back together. Oh, that, this one hurts, she says. Let me look at it. it. This um, one this is also says, cracked? Oh, this dear. This one says that it works. Oh, no. I love seeing the kids playing pretend. I think she might have brain problems. What? Okay, let me try. Do you have brain problems? I think it's probably a bad head headache. The confirmation is that you might have to stay in the hospital for about 10 weeks or a year. In six years. Yeah. Whoa, this is getting worse by the moment. Until she's sick. Now it's my turn to go. So they said there might be something wrong with your brain. No. I'm just sick. Pretend. For sure. For sure just pretend. Really, you're healthy, huh? Um, I'm so grateful you're really healthy. Yay! The brain problem was actually not that um, bad because, you know, only when she's four years old it will stop. Oh, good. So we're finishing a family read aloud during lunchtime. I love reading to my kids during lunchtime because they're quiet and they're a captive audience. So this is the book we're finishing up. Tom Eversole picked up his basket of groceries and walked out. Then Sham walked softly inside and listened to Mr. Conley count the eggs Manuel Green had brought. How did the flower come out of the bag? Because there was a hole in the bag. Who did he you? didn't know that. Yeah. I'm really frustrated right now because I've told my kids like a million times, don't touch my computer, and one of them went in there and they took the mouse. And now we can't find it. And my computer isn't a computer that can function without the mouse, and so I'm just looking all over my house for this mouse, and I can't find it. And it makes me mad, because when you need to find something and you can't find it, doesn't it make you frustrated? Slow deep breaths. Well, I've looked and looked for the mouse, and then I troubleshooted with a mouse I did find, and then I called in the expert. The big guns. He's going old school. What is this thing? <laughs> There's a cord that's connected to the mail. So hey! Does it work? That's why we keep old stuff around. Yep, let's stick it up in. Thank you, Jeremy, your magic. You make all my problems disappear. That's why you have a husband. <laughs> hey, uh, hi. There we go, there's a hi. Do you still hate your car seat? I know, I know. Here's a binky. Here's a blanket. Still hate it. So the last couple days have actually been pretty hectic around here and I keep forgetting to go grocery shopping and so it's dinner time and we have absolutely nothing so we're gonna go to Chick-fil-A. Do you see the Christmas tree? I, I saw, I saw an Olaf from there. Oh, how fun. Hey Laura, could you sing a little bit louder for us? Laura, go get in the car. You need to get your shoes on and a jacket. It's gymnastics time. <laughs> So how is violin? Good. Okay, get your jammas on. So we've started reading with our kids in bed to kind of calm down before we actually have them go to sleep. What are you reading, Laura? Christmas books. Christmas books. So what are you reading, Cub? The box Crip Children. And it's a 150 page book. Is this your longest book you've ever read? Yeah, but the second is 120. Are you liking the book? Yeah. Well, tonight I went out shopping and attempted to finish up our Christmas shopping, but it didn't work out. Different stores were out of things that I was hoping they would have, and some things looked different in person, and so it didn't really work out. It was a little discouraging. I meant to vlog when I was out, but I just honestly wasn't feeling up to it. I'm feeling really tired today, but more than that, I'm feeling emotionally depleted. I'm feeling anxious, and I can feel even my anxiety like in my 
neck and my shoulders, like maybe, maybe tension or stress is a better word for that. But I can just kind of feel that with the traveling we just did and some of the big decisions that Jeremy and I have been making and just, you know, the hustle and bustle of everything, I can tell that I'm needing to take some time for myself. I need to get a good night's sleep tonight. I need to ignore whatever work stuff I need to be getting done and instead make a big cup of hot chocolate and sit and watch one of those cheesy, predictable Christmas movies. And that's what I need tonight, so that's what I'm gonna do. I hope you guys are having a good night. Be sure to take care of yourself this season. So Kendra just showed me the coolest thing she just bought. So they look like normal everyday winter gloves. I just bought new gloves. But. Check this out. Swipeity swipe. Swipeity swipe. So they're actually advertised as phone friendly gloves and it's the differences on this finger and this finger. The other fingers. You can't operate your phone with those fingers. I can totally use my phone with my gloves on. It's amazing. Maybe this is old news to everybody else, but I'm feeling pretty <laughs> schnazzy. Poll question, how much do you think the gloves cost? I'll put some options in the poll, like zero to five, six to 10, 11 to 15, 16 to 20, and 21 to 25. And comment below if you think I should become a hand model, because <laughs> that's the thing. <laughs> You're already there. Look at that. And the answer is... $4.88. Nice. Say bye. Bye. There's the bye. Good night, Jay House out. All right, the big question. Will we be having another baby?